Hello everyone, Harvey and I are in Norfolk today. We are staying at a really lovely place called Settle in Norfolk for two nights. And we actually only really have one full day of exploring while we're here, which is today. Um, so we have driven over to the Norfolk coast, the North Norfolk coast. And um, I asked on Instagram for any recommendations for you guys and I got so many. So we've had to be um, fairly selective of what we wanna do today. Um, because we don't have a long time and we also really want to make the most of where we're staying and just kind of relax and everything as well but our first stop of the day is a place called Creek Abbey um, and the reason I wanted to come here <laughs> is actually because there is a lifestyle store with um, which also sells baby things and um, I'm 23 weeks pregnant now I haven't actually been to like any baby shops so I'm kind of keen to like just have a little look also seems really nice here there is um, the ruins of the old abbey which we might go have a look at and there's a cafe and a food hall um, so yeah we're gonna have a little look around and then we're gonna head over to the coast and go to the beach it's not the nicest of days so I think we're just gonna have a wander along the beach um, it's a little bit cloudy and overcast today but excited to be exploring Norfolk for one day only we'll definitely have to come back um, because yeah I got so many recommendations so you guys seem to really love it lots of you guys live here as well so it seems like there's lots of nice cafes and shops and beautiful beaches and marshes and windmills and yeah all sorts to do here so definitely want to come back to um but yeah we'll take you along on our day in norfolk came over to Wells by the Sea on the coast and had a little walk along the beach with all the little cabins. Yeah, yeah beach huts are super nice, aren't they? Yeah, really nice, like... Very cute. Yeah, very cute, lots of different colours. <laughs> and um, now we're just walking back through the woods. This is Hokum Nature Reserve and it was highly recommended by many of you. It's amazing in here. Yeah, it's beautiful. I love these coastal woodlands. They have like a really nice feel about them quite unique yeah I don't know if this is like a naturalized woodland um, mm. with the black pine but yeah there's lots of foxgloves and oh, yeah, it's, amazing. it's beautiful <laughs> Good looking cake. <laughs> mm. Carrot cake. Mm. 
so moist. We are back at the cabin now, having had a really nice day exploring a little corner of Norfolk. Uh, yeah, we didn't have loads of time and we wanted to make the most of being here as well, so not get back too late. So we can cook dinner here and just chill for the evening. So yeah, we only managed to see a few little bits here and there, but it was so beautiful. I really loved going to the beach. I loved the little lifestyle store we went to. And then after that, we popped into somewhere called Stiff Key Stores just to get a coffee and cake <laughs> and pick up a few provisions for dinner as well. And then we headed over to Clay and popped into Clay Smokehouse where we got some smoked salmon and smoked prawns for dinner and we went into the clay pottery place as well and I didn't buy anything but everything was super nice in there um, but I thought I might show you what I bought from Marshes and Flint which was the first uh, shop we went to I got a few baby things so I'll show you quickly now so this is what I got from Marshes and Flint this is a little toy rattle we don't actually have any toys yet so we got that and we also got this really cute really soft little duck um love that harvey really liked that as well so <laughs> that's nice and then this little really cozy little teddy bear suit which will be for three to six months so in the heart of winter and just a little muslin cloth because everyone's told me how many muslin cloths i need um this is a really nice soft one it was such a lovely store <laughs> I'm just boiling some potatoes for our dinner and thought I would give you a little tour of the cabin we're staying in uh, because it is really, really nice. <laughs> it is probably up there with Inverlonen as the nicest place I've ever stayed. Um, we did pay for it. It was quite pricey, but it was a treat. I booked it when I found out I was pregnant because I thought I'm never gonna stay here with a baby or kids. So yeah, it was just a little bit of a treat, a little bit of a summer treat, so. So I'll show you the outside properly in a minute, but this is the front deck and then you walk in. So we've been staying here, so we've got stuff around. It's not quite as nice as when we first <laughs> arrived, but yeah, here is the main cabin area. <laughs> this is the kitchen, which is absolutely amazing. Table, Harvey's doing some editing. Buongiorno. <laughs> Got dinner cooking. Um, yeah, it's a bit of a mess, but you know, you get the picture. It's a very nice. Everything here is just like so thought through. There's like beautiful crockery. Yeah, it's just stunning. There's a helicopter outside, so I'm gonna stop. Stop. Here, you can see it from another angle. Two really nice cozy chairs. And there's a wood burner here as well. So it's all made from reclaimed wood. And I think the couple who own it, the guy owns the re reclamation yard, I think. So going through to the bedroom, just try and find the lights. <laughs> so this is the bedroom. The bed is huge and I love the sheets. This is that brand called Piglet in Bed. And I've been eyeing them up for ages, but they're really expensive. So. <laughs> but yeah, it's a pretty cozy bed. And then you go through to the bathroom, which is probably like one of the most beautiful aspects of the cabin. So nice. There's this bath. And then there's a shower. And... <laughs> it's just super nice and that looks out on the deck I'll show you a full full view now so this is the lake in front of the cabin fortunately we haven't had a lot of sun but it's beautiful anyway and this is what the cabin looks like from the front Beautiful.
And there's also this little boat house area, and this is an outdoor bath. Fits two of us, which is great. <laughs> so we've got a fire light lit in there, and that's warming up the water for the bath. We actually went in this already yesterday, and we're having another one tonight. <laughs> And there's this really nice deck. We had our tea out here this morning with the wood burner. Oh, it's just started raining. And yeah, this just looks right over the lake. It's actually really nice that it's raining. I kind of feel like I like the cozy vibes here. I first discovered Settle on Instagram and when I saw it I was like wow if we ever built a house Harvey this is what I would want it to look like and he kind of agreed so that was part of the incentive of coming here to actually see it in in the flesh and yeah it is just as beautiful as it looks in the photos so yeah <laughs> would definitely recommend if you ever get a chance to come here it is really really amazing. Got smoked salmon, potatoes with coriander and a really nice salad for dinner and a few of the hot smoked or smoked prawns as well from the smokehouse in clay mm -hmm. 